voice of cars, the hit man himself, Shane Striker Star.
John Wyborn, he's not a pretty fighter, folks. In fact, he's a very unorthodox one, but John Wyborn knows what it's all about. He's been fighting the best of the best for a long time, and that experience should hold him in good stead as he prepares to take on the butcher, Brent Zanketa, here tonight. And listen to the ovation for the man they call the butcher, Brent Zanketa. The undefeated cruiserweight has a huge following here in Brisbane and will need every ounce of encouragement tonight as he squares up against the veteran John Wyborn. Mark the hammer, Castanetti along with Michael Chavello. The crowd have gone absolutely bananas. Hammer for the butcher, Bretanchera. Certainly, Bretanchera, he has a huge supporter base. It's underway in the first round of action. We were talking to the butcher before the fight out in the change rooms and he said he's going to go downstairs and take out the legs of the digger. But John Wyborn, he's fought the best of the best and he's beaten them. Wyborn just dumped into the canvas that time, please. Mark, would you say that Zanketa, being a Queenslander, has the advantage with knees? Johnny Wyborn does most of his fighting in New South Wales, where, of course, knee fighting is not allowed. Well, knee fighting is uh, it's not one of the more popular uh, styles in, uh, in New South Wales Stop. due to government regulations. But um, certainly, uh, Brett Zanketa is well-schooled in, in grappling and kneeing. And it will come down to the, uh, the hardness of, the, of these two warriors to see who will uh, come out on top. Wyborn also made his boxing. Down. There's John Wyborn just sticking out the front kick off the left leg to begin it. Zanketa ties him up and tries to work those knees. They both exploded in this round. <laughs> Wyborn just spinning Zanketa against the ropes. Backing him, sweeping leg kick there. By just popped him with the left. It has quite enough muster behind it. Better, rather than having a wide grapple, you need to get your hands right up on the inside of the neck into the striking knee. And a small cut was opened above the left eyebrow of John Wyborn. Mark the hammer at the moment, I feel that John Wyborn is going pretty well toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Right, well trying to grapple. Wyborn 
trying to sting him with the left hand. Then Kenneth firing wildly with left and right to the head. Ties the digger up over in the red corner. Wide ball goes downstairs. One too many of those kicks to the fly would make Brent Tankett a wish he was someplace else. And the blood again. continuing to flow from the eyebrow of John Wybon. He'll get it attended to yet again from his corner. Just wipe it. I want to get it. immediately trying to plant the left hand on that cut brow. They're slugging toe to toe, folks. Look at them go over in the neutral corner. A man that has done it himself is not just uh, an aficionado. He has actually put the gloves on and been in there, so he knows what it's all about. They waltz over into the blue corner, all tied up. And stings him with the left hand. Zank had a response with a left hook of his own. Watch the groin. And the blood of the groin okay. was felt that groin. time by Zanketa. Brett, you're okay. There was nothing in that. Fight on. A nice left kick to end the round for John the Digger. Wipe on Mark the hammer. The crowd really getting behind him. The Digger moves in with the leg kick, ties Zanketa up. to the midsection there by John Wyborn trying to get one up to the head. Did only let a good lead knee go. Wyborn almost took his head off with that knee. Zanketa will have to be gone. Wyborn comes out slugging with the hands, ties Zanketa up against the ropes right in front of our country position. Clubbing left hook. Stings him with the left and the right. On my scorecard, this will be the deciding round. It's been even up until this point. Wyborn perhaps came on strongly in the last round, just launches that high left round kick and ties Zanketa up. And throws the butcher to the canvas. Wyborn said in the break, Zanketa's going to have to work hard because Johnny Wyborn has scored very well with some of his own knee strikes. Another throw to the canvas by Wyborn. This is putting... Launching that high right round kick and sweeps out to get a supporting oh, yeah. right on. Leave an opening and Tommy Wybourne will find it. The digger has declared war. He's declared it here tonight on the butcher Brett Zanketa. Goes to the Brent basket with the right hand. Comes over the top with the big right. A knee to the head caught Zanketa. Wybourne just firing another deadly knee to the temple. And there's the high left round kick by the digger. Zanketa chops him down with the leg kick. The crowd rallying behind the butcher Brett Zanketa. He has to bring home the bacon and he has to do it now. Give me those gloves. Fight! Spinning hook kick there by Wyborn didn't quite find the mark. Let him go. Both men now very tired. Brett, please. And you think back at uh, the Steel there. Ring Warriors have to dig very deep indeed. Zanketa trying to take out the legs of John Wyborn. Wyborn trying to plant one of those good night Irene knees to the head. There's another one by the digger. Zanketa needs to do the fifth and final round of cruiserweight action between the butcher and the digger. Mark the hammer, it's gone down to the judges. What a war. Well, what a war it was indeed, Michael. With uh, Tony Wyborn coming home quite well. But Dan Cheddar looking a little, a little tired here tonight. But uh, nevertheless, putting up a brave effort.